Hello and welcome to this reaction of One Piece the anime. We are on season one, episode 10. Last episode, we got to meet Usopp. We got a little backstory on why Luffy knows Yasopp. And I liked, I actually liked this Usopp a little bit better than the live action one. So I had a lot of fun with it. Obi and Haircut were the, the name of the, the other two that I was thinking of. And I thought about it halfway through the episode. I just, bad memory. I forgot to say it. So by the way, if this is your first time here. My memory, or as I like to joke around, me and my family uh, call it a room memory because mine is terrible. So without further ado, get to the show and see where it goes. Not me. I came here to see you. I wanted to ask you a favor. A favor from me? Uh-huh. I was wondering if there was any way you could help us get a boat. You there. <laughs> the kids what are do fine, too. What you think too. you're doing? Clador. Oh, yeah, this guy. All right, Michael Jackson. Who's there? He even looks like him. What is this? Uh, actually, Clahador, these people are... Not now, Kaya. You can tell me all about this riffraff after they've left. Oh. Usopp! Crap! You have quite the reputation. <laughs> you are very well known in the village. <laughs> sure am. I hear you've been on many an adventure. Quite impressive for someone as young as you. You'll never be anything more than the son of a filthy pirate. Who knows what uh -oh. sort of trouble you're up to now. All I ask is that you and your kind leave this respectable young lady alone. A filthy pirate? My goal isn't to slander. I am merely stating the truth. I sympathize with your situation. You must hate your great idiot of a father for abandoning his family and his village. Don't you dare insult my father ever again! Uh, up? <laughs> oh, nice. Like that Why a lot. have you gotten so worked up, Usopp? It's times like these when you should do what you do best and lie. Tell me about how your father is really a traveling salesman, or about how you aren't really related by blood. Yo! I am proud to say that my old man is a brave warrior of the sea. You're right, I have been known to exaggerate from time to time, but I will never lie about who my father is. I refuse to be ashamed of my heritage. I am the son of a pirate! <laughs> That's quite a twisted way of putting things. Dude, his shoes are too much. You don't seem to understand. Your father is a filthy, no good pirate. Treachery is in your blood. Of course you would hatch such an evil scheme. You won't let up, will you? Stop it, Usopp, please! No more violence. I can't take it. Invite him in. <laughs> Bite your friends in. Leave this place. You are never to come here again. Not so! Shut up, you don't have a bone to pick with him. <sighs> what are you doing? Don't hide behind me! Now they're hiding behind Why were you I wonder so if it's cruel blue like the live action was. I know I was wrong to talk to Usopp without telling you. I will admit that much, and I'm very sorry for not being honest with you. But this situation did not warrant that kind of harsh treatment. It has been quite some time since I first arrived at this house. Soon it will be three years that I have been in the service of your family. I will never forget what happened when I showed up at your father's door. Oh, she was healthy. I had been kicked off the ship I worked on for some small blunder I had made. And with no work or money, I was on the verge of dying like a beggar. <laughs> hey, you! Beat it! Get out of here! This isn't the place for the likes of you! <laughs> What? But, sir, he... I understood. He just doesn't talk. Take him inside and tend to him. I wouldn't have taken such a bold step unless I thought it absolutely necessary. It's just that Usopp isn't exactly known for his upstanding character. You see, if anything were to happen to you, it would be my fault for not seeing to your safety and I... But I stand by my opinion. Usopp is one of the nicest people I know. We'll see about that. Until then, he is still not welcome here. Clahador! You blockhead! Blockhead will do just fine. I still don't get it. It's her house. Why is this guy moonwalking? 
He literally looks like Michael Jackson. Some nut job is on his way here and he only walks backwards. You liar. It's the truth. There he is. Huh? He literally moonwalks everywhere. <laughs> now it's when it's what? You fools. What makes you think that I would want to reveal my masterful hypnosis techniques to a bunch of roadside strangers? Okay, you convinced me. Now watch the ring closely. Oh, what? Um, so, one, two, jungle! <laughs> Who is this freaky weirdo? What? What just happened? Did he put himself to sleep? I can't believe that butler. Insulting my old man like that. Yeah, I hate that guy too. No matter what anyone says, Yasop was a great pirate. Yeah, really? I'll consider it if that butler apologizes to me for the things he said. That butler right there? He ain't gonna yeah, apologize to you. That's the one. If he... What in the world is he doing down here? What's a big idea? Hey, perfected the skills of the chameleon. I blend in. There's someone else with no, him, and man, don't. is he weird. I've never seen him before. Who is he? So... Have all the necessary preparations been made? We can start any time. On the rich girl murder plan! <laughs> murder? Quiet! Be quiet! Oh my goodness. Don't I knew it was gonna happen. <laughs> I don't like the sound of it. Oh right, accident. It's an accident that you planned. So basically, on your signal, the men and I storm the village and manage to accidentally kill the little rich girl. Then you get her inheritance and we all get paid, right? You moron! Your ignorance is astounding! And it will say I leave my entire fortune to my butler, Clahador. <laughs> then and only then will I have undisputed control of her enormous fortune. And reveal and no who I really am. no suspect a thing. Captain Kuro. Three years ago, you suddenly said you were giving up life as a pirate. In no time at all, you set up someone to be your double. Then you let the world see Captain Kuro get executed. Ooh. That expl- I like that story. In other words, I'm a pacifist. <laughs> the pacifist you are! Murdering an entire family doesn't exactly qualify as peaceful. Wow, Hold they on. just put it all out there. I haven't murdered an entire family. The father's death wasn't planned. Whatever you... Okay. You're gonna fall again, little buddy. This is horrible. But Captain Kuro is alive and well, posing as Clawdor the butler. And he's had his diabolical sights set on Kaya's fortune for the last three years. Hmm. Patience. And that is diabolical. We're still attack the village. Hey, bad guys, you better stay away from that girl. Who are you? Luffy. You idiot, they spotted you. Come on, hurry up and hide before they decide you need a long, slow death. Well, now, if it isn't Luffy. Usopp, the mischievous town liar. <laughs> Pay attention, boys, and watch this ring closely. Hmm? Okay. Don't you get it? It's some kind of weapon. We gotta run! Jungle! <laughs> Jungle, you idiot! I see you're still falling asleep on the job! <laughs> but there's no way he could have survived. This can't be happening. They killed him! He's really dead! Everything he could say would sound like lies. <gasps> Jungle, tomorrow at daybreak, the men are to attack the village. Tomorrow? And they're just assuming Luffy's just dead? Just it, Usopp. There is nothing you can say or do to warn the villagers of this impending tragedy. <laughs> pirates! That guy is gonna be killed! You can't yell for pirates, because... I can't let that happen to the people I love! And I love the inner monologue they, show, they have in this show. Oh my goodness. She's the first person you should run to. No! Cat 
pirates. I love it. Heart pirates, clown pirates, cat pirates. <laughs> I love it. Here for it all. You know, my little crab friend just can't win. 0 for 3 up that cliff. 0 for 3. He keeps going back. So we got the the claw claw door. I think is that how they pronounce it. I, I'm bad with names. I'm sorry. We got his reveal. The Django guy is a hypnotist who apparently falls asleep every time he tries hypnotizing someone. Uh, so I'm very curious if they're going to have Yasop Usop Usop run through the village yelling the pirates are here, kind of like he did in the, the live action. I, I'm very curious to see how they do that that part, but. This is a neat episode, you know, it it got reveals that if I hadn't watched the live action before would be very interesting, like the, you know, the, the pirate of the, the the captain of the cat pirates uh, in a uh, claw door and uh, how he didn't kill the father, but apparently he did the mother and the father's death was accidental. That was, that was really a kind of interesting twist on that. And it it'll be I think it'll be really fun to see what they do with yeah you know, how Nami and uh, Luffy and Zoro actually you know fight this battle. I want to see I want to see how different it is from the the live action. Uh, dude, this this little arc in the live action, the fights in it were probably some of my favorite in the in the show. So, but I I, I enjoyed this one very much. It was. Like I said, it was really interesting, different, enjoyable, and it'll be fun to see where it goes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction with me. If you did, like, share, subscribe. If you didn't, thanks for watching this along. Uh, find me on Discord, comment below, and until next time, take care.